टॉपिक नंबर नाइन डिफ्रेंशिएशन टॉपिक नंबर नाइन डिफ्रेंशिएशन फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल फॉर्मूला फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल फॉर्मूला एफ एस एक्स इज इक्वल टू लिमिट एज एच टेन्स टू जीरो एफ ऑफ एक्स प्लस एच माइनस एफ ऑफ एक्स अपॉन एच फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल फॉर्मूला एफ एस एक्स इज इक्वल टू लिमिट एज एच टेन्स टू जीरो एफ ऑफ एक्स प्लस एच माइनस एफ ऑफ एक्स अपॉन एच क्वेश्चन Find the derivatives of the following function functions. From the definition. From the definition, this is important word. First question is root x. Find the derivatives of the following functions from the definition. First, first function is root x. Definition that means by using means first principle. Formula. Finding derivative by using definition that means using first. principal formula and finding derivative now this is the function fx is equal to take root x fx is equal to root x f of x plus h where there is a x right x plus h so root x plus h fx root x f of x plus h That means where there is x in this statement, right? X plus h, so root x plus h. Then definition of derivative f dash is is equal to limit as h tends to zero, not x. H tends to zero. F of x plus h minus f of x upon h. Is equal to limit at x tends to zero. F of x plus h is root x plus h minus f x is root x upon h. In this formula, put proper values and limit. Now next step is we have to solve this limit. If we see then in this question there are roots. When there are roots and we want to find limit, take complex conjugates respectively. Here there is root at numerator, so take complex conjugate of numerator and therefore is equal to limit as it tends to zero. This term as it is root x plus h minus root x upon h. Complex conjugate of this term is root x plus h plus root x. Multiply this term and divide by this term. Same term. When we want to solve limit and roots are there, take complex conjugates respectively. Here, roots, root terms at numerator, so take complex conjugate of no, complex conjugate of numerator. So 
Here is complex conjugates only here plus sign. So root x plus h plus root x. Multiply by that term and divide by that term. Write here brackets. Is equal to limit as h tends to 0. If we take this term as m, this term as m, then same terms are here, this term is m and this term is m. That means root x plus h is m. Root x is m. And read this m minus n into n plus n. In the bracket m minus n into in the bracket n plus n. This product is always n square minus n square. Product is n square minus n square. Therefore, square of this term, square of this term means square and root get cancelled. Only x plus h minus square of this term, square and root get cancelled x. m square minus n square, square of this term, square and root get cancelled x plus h minus square of this term, square and root get cancelled x at the denominator product h and this term root x plus h plus root x x get cancelled limit as h tends to 0 h upon h root cos x plus h h bracket root x plus h plus root x factor from numerator and denominator get cancelled put value of h 1 upon root h h get cancelled so here is 1 1 upon a root root x plus h is 0 plus root x this value is x plus 0 is x so this value is root x now root x plus root x is 2 root x so 1 upon 2 root x root x plus root x 2 root x 1 upon 2 root x 1 upon 2 root x this is the answer 1 upon 2 root x